So an anti-bubble, just describe what exactly do you mean by so much focus just on these high profile, uh, you know, flashy companies like Apple. Yeah, so I think that's the entire point, which is that the, uh, uh, that the market value of Apple and Amazon and some of these tech companies had become so large that it was dwarfing some of these other countries with pretty decent economic fundamentals. And so much has been spoken about bubbles, that there's a lot of hype about these uh, companies and why bubbles burst, but not enough is sort of spoken about anti-bubbles, which is in a right. way the mirror image of bubbles. Right. And I'm not right. talking about anti-bubbles of companies or countries that aren't doing well. Right. But these are countries and They're companies doing well anyway. that are doing yes. like pretty well, yes. but all because they don't fit the hype. And the hype of the last decade has been all about America and all about technology, that these the countries and their stock markets have done quite poorly compared to America, even though their economic growth rates are quite, quite decent good. and their and uh, also, fundamentals are quite good. These companies have dominated so much that everything else has been neglected. So this is the mirror image of a decade ago. A decade ago, it was all these emerging markets, India, which were dominating. And some of these companies, you are hadn't even been conceived or you hadn't even heard of them or they were being neglected, right. like the likes of Netflix and Amazon. Yeah. Their business models were being questioned and then they boomed. And then countries like India and Indonesia, the other countries that I showed, did quite poorly. So I think that yeah. we could once again be setting up for a role reversal in the coming few years. In you general, mentioned. I think that yes. you know, like the bubble is mainly in the US and the anti-bubbles are in its shadow across, uh, spread uh, around the world. Right. Some of those are more extreme, as we pointed out, like right. Eastern Europe or Southeast Asia. And then you also have countries like right. India, which have been overshadowed by the rise of uh, these tech companies.